Okay, hi everyone. So this is a past year question coming from the summer paper of 2010. So in this question, we're actually given two functions, a line function, which is y plus 2x equals 7, and also a curve where it's equals to y equals to x minus 2 squared. And what we are supposed to do is find this shaded region. Okay, the area of this area shaded region. So we can do that by actually uh, using integrals. So first we actually find the area that is bounded by the x-axis by the line graph and then minus it off with the area bounded by the curve. But before that, what we need to do is actually to find the coordinates of x for point A and B. And we can do that by equating uh, the two equations. Let me rearrange this equation to y equals to negative 2x plus 7. Okay, and what we do is we equate them together. So we get negative 2x plus 7 equals to x minus 2 squared. So we actually have negative 2x plus 7 equals to x squared minus 4x plus 4. And we actually get x squared minus 2x minus 3 equals to 0. And we should be able to find the roots, which is going to be x minus 3, x plus 1 equals to 0. Therefore, we actually get one root value, which is x equals to negative 1 and x equals to 3. Okay, so now for us to find the area of the shaded region, what we need to find do is area. Let me write it as shaded. This will be equals to area that is given by the line graph, so area under the line graph between points A and B, minusing of area that is given by the curve. Okay, so this then involves the integration of x from negative 1 to 3 of negative 2x plus 7 delta x minus integration of x from negative 1 to 3 x minus 2 squared okay delta x and you can see since the range are the same for both of them x from negative 1 to 3 uh, from both for both of these integrals i can actually use the rule where i can actually sum up the functions in within it and as we have done from our equating the uh, equations, we know that this, when I actually minus off with the other side, this will be equals to x to the power, sorry, x integrating from 1 to 3 of the function of negative x squared plus 2x plus 3 delta x. And this gives us negative x cubed over 3 plus 2x squared over 2 plus 3x and we substitute the values of negative 1 and 3 to find the area so if you calculate correctly each this should give us 10 2 over 3 units okay um, what I want to do is extension of this you can also double check that the methodology is correct I would like to calculate the area bounded by the line with the x-axis separately from the area bounded by the curve with the x-axis so that's what we're going to do here so area of the line so this is equals to integral of x equals to negative 1 2 3 negative 2 x plus 7 delta x and this would give us negative 2x squared over 2 plus 7x okay, and you calculate it from negative 1 to 3 and this should give you a value of 20 so while the area of the curve this will be integral of x from negative 1 to 3 x minus 2 squared delta x this is if you expand it so this will be integral of negative 1 to 3 x squared minus 4x plus 
4 delta x and this will give you x cubed over 3 minus 4x squared over 2 plus 4x and you calculate from negative 1 to 3 and this should give you a value of 9 1 third so if you were to uh, minus off the area that is bounded by the line uh, with the area that is bounded by the curve you would see that you actually get the same value as 10 203